even when you have the certificate covid ikikuja uweze ambia haya matendo kwa certificate hazeni kwa certificate unanikujia kwa nini tafuta wenye wana tafuta wenye wana za tv i think yes. according to unacheki sisi ni watu wenye tuko kwa ground yeah kwa ground yenyewe hakuna vaccine Yes, yes. Hello, hello. Happy New Year, guy. Happy New Year 2022. Karibuni sana kwa ground, ni Maestro Kasmil and Christian Angaya. By this day market your channel. Ya nini? Lakini wewe unaonekana wewe ya kwanza. Podcast. Podcast yes. Christian. Christian Angaya. Hajo, yule jamaa tumie tu jina yake ya Kevondo inajulika. Christian Angaya. Christian Angaya. Kwa hiyo Kevin Angaya. Kevin Angaya, sawa. Beti yo kuza mesema. Kevo. Kevo, yes. Sa, so, karibuni sana kwa the ground. And, eh, kwa the ground. Kwa ground. Naja ni Kiswahili kwa za uh, Kiswahili name. So, karibuni sana. It's uh, 2022 na tumanza na psych. And we are so psyched up here. Just, kuna letu na whatever we are doing. Now, naka tufanya tu cover up ya last year. Like, tufanya tu summary in a very brief moment. And uh, we might not pick on everything, but I'll pick you just one or two things here and there. So, Uh, bear with us. Ni nini tukikosa kusema mnaweza andika hapo kwa comment comment section yes. Tuseme tulia hata aje hiyo. Yeah, how? Yeah, in fact, how do we kwanza? How do we? But sasa unajua tu zianza kama tutachapa story ya COVID. COVID COVID-19. Tuko 2022. Took like three years. Three years from the time you came to Zimbabwe up to now. Two years boy. Two. 2020 2021. 2019. We are now in the third year. I don't 2019. Aje. Likuja COVID-19. 2019 November. Yeah, 2019 so, November. So 2020 November. Okay. 2021. We are going to come here. 2019. Oh, okay. <laughs> 2020. 2021. 2021. Then it's 3. Okay. 2022. Four years. Is it four? Is it four? Is it four? 2019 <laughs> November, 2020 November. I'm going to come to 2021 November. Wait. To the year 3 sasa. Ah, see. 2019. Yes. Uh-huh. 2020. 2021. Uh-uh. Tuko 2022. Ah ah. Tuko 2022. Kevo Isabu 2020. 2021. Yeah, 2023 as for Kevo. So 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 yeah, story you met to fanyikia for all that time and now we are here 2022 and the positivity rate kwa 32%. 27% higher than the WHO recommended. Tunafanya ni twende lockdown tena. Ah, okay fine. Tunakuwa na how many cases per per, per day? Like 2000s more, even thousands actually. Like in the test men like up to the last time ilangal kwa around 11000. Then 11000 tests ile kwa 3200. Mm. Uh, uh, walikuwa na Okay. But I don't think we should, should lock yet. Tusifunge ba. Eh? Tusifunge. Hakuna pesa. Kuna survive game ya kuletea food kwa nyumba that now. So hey. But you saw the other time, just use it too before we cross over to this year, before transition to the traveling. Uh, president alikuwa meita the press. Wakaka hapo inje akimngojea kuja kwa address. Sama kuna msaka mwambie mazi history lenga. Cuz you remember tukianza December alikuwa amesema oh sijui wewe travel kama una certificate. Uh sijui vitu kama hizo and stuff like that. But then it kept going like eh, it's like ile status so meta press kafiu kafi ilikuwa na trend hapo juu because mm-hmm. Rwanda may get back to lockdown Uganda the same i think sijui Canada sijui wapi and uh, it's like Kenya kuna another kuna kind of that kind of feeling hiyo kitu inakuja but then somehow tukalenga and now we are now at 32% positivity rate and in apparo in apanda and no one is worried kenya ni au vaccinatedwa ama wenye wana shida ni nini kiangalia wale wenye wenye uoga ni ile unaweza kufa bwana but sasa hii atogopi atogopi kufa tu kwa unaweza kufa njaa bado sasa mimi naogopa kukufa but but sisi wa usi watu watatushapata covid 19 so our immunity iko high we we can do see miss spend do see we will end do see kuna medicine no nili nilitumia medication medication kwa sasa umebaki kwa under medication ah mazee nilisikia 
wanataka certificate unacheki una <laughs> kuna job za government nataka kuomba <laughs> na government imesema huwezi pata any, any job mm. bila certificate bila certificate, certificate yes. imekuwa important kama hizi za za KCP KCC mm. so ku apply job lazima uko attach certificate yeah vaccination yeah but should be unafaa kuwa discriminated because una certificate ya covid 19 yeah i think that unafaa kuwa discriminated consider and then unless you're in a mile on a mask so i think that so far do the, the vaccine helps a lot especially for those who have, who interact with many people kama the politicians mm. but come on have a mask i don't think you should be discriminated against so babu the first thing you're taking the first lead of priority una natumia sanitizers unaosha mikono unavaa mask mbona mm. waambie no sababu uta uta infect mtu kama umevaa mask yeah true sababu mbona waambie usifanye hapa no unaingia hapo kwa na mask hapo nje umeosha mikono au na mbona usiingia sababu hujapata vaccine utamgiza mtu aje kama umevaa mask kama umevaa mask and uh, and uh, history ni mwana tena gavana sasa since nimeshindwa ku implement hiyo story ya ku travel bila ku vaccinated wameza mm. kuambia watu like supermarket msi allow mtu kuja buy something kama hana certificate ya vaccination said to vaccinate uh, close to 10 million people but 4000 ah not 4000 4 million they were fully vaccinated, vaccinated. and the remaining wako half mm eh wengine wameanza kuendea booster sasa is it only that the 4 million they were allowed only to get services and the rest of us mta kuwa allowed mkae tivo i think maybe you can say to the government of Africa to think about the strategy of vaccination because even when you have the certificate covid ikikuja wewe ziambia mataji kwa certificate hazeni kwa certificate unanikujia kwa nini tafuta wenye wana tafuta wenye wana certificate i think yes. according to unacheki sisi ni watu wenye tuko kwa ground yeah kwa ground yenye wako na vaccine <laughs> yes oh tu ifike 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 place yenye ifike place yenye kila mtu ungefaa u like prevent watu kuingia kwa super because ana haja uh, vaccinatedwa mm. ingefaa ikue mm. umeleta vaccine kwa every point mm. enye mse anyone mwenye kwa ground anaweza ipata akitoka hapa ingie kwa stage anataka kupanda gari kuna mtu mwenye ako na vaccine hapo akienda up, up kwa hiyo supermarket mbele hiyo supermarket yeah. kuna vaccine hapo ndio mm-hmm. sasa unaweza ambia mse enye wewe una joke wewe yeah, una joke hey. so but uh, again ukiangalia kwa villages kwa villages kuna point za vaccine Hmm. wakikuja hapa mara moja waweke the next day yawako kwa hiyo place wa wameenda another place Zinesha, so like eh hey, so like uwezi Zinesha. Zinesha. uwezi penalize mse huh? juu ya uja vaccinatedwa hiyo Ju- vaccine iko wapi kuna places zingine na vaccine ngendo hospitali nyingine anaweza kaniambia na vaccine from early in the morning to midday most hospitals wanafanya hivyo sasa kama umeenda kazi utaenda hapo saa ngapi sasa hizo ndio issue ingefaa you pick a place yenye hata hizo kazi zenye hizo places za kazi vaccines zimekuja huko so that ukilenga wewe wewe so what the government do to wewe ndio ukwe answerable eh wewe ndio ukwe answerable we explain to the government now kwa nini ya utaki if i can say religious exemptions religious gani na ngine gani na kupa exemption gani waislamu wako sawa nayo the catholics are good also utakataga religious means like even even being a vegetarian that's a religion religion oh but they are still heads of those religions no you don't have we don't have heads of vegetarian the government which pia i think he ever could another certificate yeah, yeah maybe Kukonu to explain to other supermarket to supermarket kwa nini ya vaccinatedwa but then you, i had uruk when uh, the new year's message was it new year's or christmas alsema the intention of the government is that by the end of 2022 tumekuwa tume vaccinate 30 million people so basically we will still have 20 million people wenye joko vaccinated na au pia bado una check si makosa yao eh uh, si, si makosa yao kutokuwa vaccinated uh-huh. ni venye government sahi hata tuseme tunataka ku vaccinate kila mtu uh-huh. atuwezi hatuna uh-huh. vaccine yenye inaweza vaccinate kila mtu uh-huh. so uwezi penalize mse uh-huh. because maybe alienda hospital akapata uh-huh. kama imeisha uh-huh. na wewe unataka kumwambie aizi uh-huh. fanya shopping ama aizi ingia kwa gari because atajapo uh-huh. vaccinated na uh-huh. problems yake yake yeah, okay. ama get government services because ana 
ya so kwa ground tumekataa hiyo ya ya, ya kupenalize wase kwa supermarket mara oh, nini nini mm. kuna wase wametoka wakaenda job hawajapata hiyo vaccine I, i think governor fire is strategize when it comes to hizo sera za covid 19 na implementation so uh, that was the first thing uh, there was another guy and it was in the same same period zangila <laughs> mwenyewe <laughs> sana alitoka akalia akasema yeye ungara tu na nenda nowe kazi kwa mka kunara kwenda wewe tu inje so tu injua is it that life me was so hard ama it affects was the wingi in terms of industry said yeah but they come inisha nini nini am said yeah you guys go switching tv mo sana kina ndio kuna chenye chenye ile happen kwa industry especially mm-hmm. entertainment mm-hmm. one atuku kwa tuna expect that covid inaweza kuja mm-hmm. so most uh, artists aku kwa mejipanga for kitu kama hiyo period ya covid mm-hmm. oh because again ukiangalia hizo kitu kama hizo vitu za chachil ah sisi ati wanalipanga pesa mingi 1000 after show kitu kama hizo mm-hmm. yeah right. show ikisha 1000 so like <laughs> jamaa <laughs> alikuwa na depend kwa hiyo 1000 every Thursday ehe uh-huh. ikikatwa <laughs> ikikatwa huo jamaa na anywhere <laughs> yeah, hapo na jina kubwa so, bila hapo na jina yeah yeah hiyo ndio kenya uh-huh. industry na ina, ina, ina kuweka in that position pressure one una wewe jina kubwa kila mtu anakujua sura jina inajulikana but mfuka ina kitu Hey, yeye zelezea mtu una pesa. Hey, angalia kitu kama reporters, mm. reporters news anchors mm. ni watu wenye one una tulia na wakina Mudavadi, unaenda ku interview Raila Karen, mm. una interview Ruto Kukula Karen, anakuita Sogoi, unaona venye so like wase wenye wana kusaloni wase wenye kuna pesa. Mm-hmm. But wewe unalipa 40,000 30,000. Hey. Hey. Na sasa so news zinalipwa na hadi Eh hey, so and, so nini yako ikikatwa tu hivi ni bala ni bala unarudi kwa street kuomba mm. ah, okay watu wanateseka wapi mwa hey so kuna jina lakini hakuna pesa na furaha no watu wanakwanga na jina uh. again nini uh, industry ya Kenya entertainment ina ina recycle a few people yeah true ina recycle a think, few people i think have a problem with that mm. uh, angalia hiyo group yote yenye ilitoka saidi hainani tena amepata kazi nyingine mm. yenye inaweza msustain mimi mm. tuambia mtu alijaribu kujibu apel mutua na anapanandika nini zake mm. but sasa nani ametengeneza movie yenye tena ameita watu, watu wenye watu 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 wataidi hai wote hakuna mtu mwenye kuna ile kazi yenye ameitwa tena project fanye watu wa papa shirandu la wote hakuna nani tena ameitwa kwa project kubwa yenye tunaona huyu eh. alikuwa kwa, kwa baba Shirandula eh. ameenda kufanya movie nyingine venye unaona uh, Hollywood huita uh, kama ah, movie okay, unaitwa okay, kwa hii yeah. movie so like unaweza pata kitu yenye ina uh, nini ku keep kila time mm-hmm. haya hao watu wenye umetoka kwa hii Maria eh. yenye ilikuwa popular nani tena ku, unaona kwa another project nani wale mwenye alikuwa security thing na kwa ingine tena eh hey, sasa but ni kidogo si wote ni kidogo si main so uh, uh, industry yetu ni wanakupatia unakuwa na jina kubwa ukitoka hapo mm. hakuna mtu mwenye tena anaweza kukuwa afford mm. so wewe una hang uh, so unless you do this sasa unless you find advert or you're creative kama kama Abel Mutua kama Abel Mutua, Abel Mutua. Mm. Ndoko na kingine ndo ndo ngea boti ya yeah yeah bakia kwa YouTube. Mm. <laughs> Alafu <laughs> but kama talent students creative I think and was some make out of this season vizuri sana because mm. kwa 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 nyuma. online apart from mm. apart from hizo challenges zenye tuna tunasema za zenye zilipata watu wa entertainment mm. again kulikuwa na benefits zenye wasi wenye walikuwa nini mm. wakina mm. awinja huyo nini wamefocus kwa kina crazy kena wametoka hii time ya covid na okay youtube kwanza sana we grow yes wameweza ni wasa after hapo what next because sasa unajua binadamu ni mtu mwenye anakanga anatakanga kukua entertainment na venye clubs haziko kuwa venye nini haiko kuwa the only source of entertainment iko youtube facility is free na 
kuna in the same in the same breath bado kuna kuna watu wanatesa hii social media kuna watu wanatesa baka kiare wanashindwa nini shida ni nini amlipi tax wazee jiji mna inaitwa soft life soft life wazee mna chapa soft life lakini atuoni mali pesa like kai uche lipi re olipi olipi code kiare i think they'll come me so rather zile zitu za kufotoshopiwa like so my post oh nini nini soft life then kare yeah, ni yeah. have like eh hey, maze pole tu nilipiwa na siji ya babu na mwaba tuliko na huko kuna yule niliona alimsale post gari au mzee yeah. eh mzee hiyo gari tu ni 3.2 what million eh pesa yako iko wapi hapa sioni hapa kwa kaniko oh jina watu mna file nil nil returns but hapa hapo aje mnatenza kutesa kini anga wakifanyaje kwa sababu they have targets that they have to achieve them. so uh, maybe na that you should go na Nimeona kuna day malitumwa 102 million. Okay, wasi kwa officer kwa sema ilikuwa tu like ya lunch. <laughs> 102 million ya lunch? Hey, sasa si kuna kuna jamaa anatumia wasichana pesa sana. Kuna million 108. Wanoi tu mwingine mwingine ilikuwa 102, mwingine sijui ilikuwa 108. Million lunch. Million. Sema chat 35 sijui million. The richest person, the richest person kwa hizo vitu za Bitcoin. Just take time. Ah, Bitcoin. Mm. Give like a uh, 30 second TV for 1 minute. Okay. Yes, yes, for 1 minute. Sasa. Hey. Hey. Okay, yes. So <laughs> 108 million lunch. Time in a run. Yes, 108 million. So basically I can't like freeze me Then sijini iki are tena mengilia story. Kama ni nani? Ana investigate you sasa. And the guy mnyali tumado amesema mimi ni tumado. Na nilimtumia rush yangu do. Na mbona mbona ana hando si wanaweza suspect kulikuwa na uzado dawa za kulevia then kukalipwa or ya hizo ndio vitu tunaweza tumetoka ma reasons no bitcoin anafuanza kuregilisha sababu kitu inapoteza shot pesa bitcoin si kama watu na make pesa mi anything yenye pesa yangu inaenda na sioni mimi mimi sichezi vitu online nifanye nini mimi uliza rafiki yangu explain what what hii kitu inamaanisha nini hii pesa inatoka wapi as in nafika ile point yenye uko okay unanieleza ni due to mathematical equation hizi equations nani anazitumia sasa hiyo ni chenafiki yanga ni kama ile mimi nipate ndio kuna kazi nimefanya so I'm, I'm exchanging goods and services hii umekaa tu computer anapiga hesabu alafu naambia tu nafaa kuona hii pesa so unajiuliza hii pesa imetoka wapi wewe do worry si umeka pesa yako hapo ni ya ndio kuna kutrade unaona kwenye forex ina nini Forex na eleo. Eh, Forex na eleo. Sababu unapata kuna sema this 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 country ni fire this deal ikafire this currency kenda juu ikenda chini. Lakini hii it's a computer mm. doing mathematical equations. Sasa hiyo I think sasa mm. mimi mimi si understand hizo bits za nini. Na bado anajulizanga what what is what does it? Sababu mtu anaingia hapo amekaa like hii afaka hapo. Mimi sasa as long as no one ameiga mtu get a job ya mtu <laughs> na anaweza kuambia mali pesa ilitoka nilileka 10k hapa ikapanda ikakuwa 15 nikachukua hiyo 15 tena nikaweka nikapanda mm-hmm. to business like you can explain so ah. reason why mm-hmm. kiari nafaa kusumbua kunisumbua ukinitumia million million lakini ah, yeah, bwana million zinatokea for more but pia pia yeah. ingefaa tu ikue equation <laughs> like unajua million <laughs> million ni mingi Alafu ikuwe one note million. Lazim voja. Alafu ifanye sabi upumbavu. Wewe pia ni 50 million unataka kuona wana wetu za pesa kila mtu million. Unataka ku convince watu waje. Again na pia kama mtu bomba. Eh unataka ku convince watu waje ati mimi nilikuwa nimekaa tu kwa nyumba. Then wana wetu katokea. Mzungu aka decide tu anamtumia one note million. Ana president atashangaa. Ah ajadish me I say as long as mse hiyo pesa you can trace mali imetoka and you can ask this person umetoa pi pesa and like kuniuliza like umetoa pi pesa you know nikienda na na 1 million sign yake kwa bank mm. nafa niulize nimetoka wapi because i have it mm. na mimi i need to explain nimeuza nini nimeuza gari shamba etc etc mm. so sasa nikisema nimeuza shamba yeah i can explain so we imagine you know, unexplain ya mtu mzee umetoa pesa kwa bitcoin Bitcoin ni mean. That's why we need to upgrade our system so we can carry. Wow. Tuko na dakika ngapi? 1 minute. I think tuna somalize at your story. Okay. Mm. But carry so sa inafaa ya upgrade system zao. But nafaa fanya nini Kenya ndio tu nini do? Lakini hata wewe wewe zitak Bitcoin. Sababu zimesintegrate to Tanzania wapi hata. 
Oh yes, to get next to Ongeleli. Do you know the things called uh, metaverse? Sawa sawa. Sawa sawa. Thank you for watching this episode. Eh kuna lot yani in our 20 minutes in Anzanga to TV the next thing imeisha. Tujui how it's like to mwaga wazi kwa whatever. So make sure you subscribe, make sure you like. Eh I think we'll share the podcast ya Kevo. Uh, um, sir, if you're anything with life, um, so produce films by the way. Oh, produce by the way. I know from Mombasa, Juzi, and I'm listening to awards. You're listening to awards. You're listening to awards. You're going to number one in the category. Uh, Nini. Oh, in the category. Um, documentaries. Then Shule, you're going to number one in the category. Then you're going to go to Machaud. Tukakuwa nominated. Sabi <laughs> 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 <laughs>